Mummy. Mummy. Can you look out at the camera again? Hey guys, what do you think of this plot so far? We're having a pretty crazy time here in the world of Yeek. I hope you can join us sometime soon. Should we go to the mine dungeon, maybe? Uh, try it. Hey, I mean, you did some fights. You have one. That means I can get the stats in the next room, though, right? Yes. Yeah. The system kind of reminds me of, like, the sphere grid or something in Final Fantasy X, where it wants to be different by not having you just directly level up, but... It doesn't feel like it does enough here. Oh, yeah, right there. Blood purge it? Yeah. Okay. See? That's what I was talking about. Oh. Some of them you do fight. Like... Also, don't lose because you lose your opportunity for this permanently if you lose the fight. Oh my god, that's a no, lot of... No, I, I know. It's silly to do that. I remember that happening oh when I played. God. You can probably get it. You got uh, it. So you did it. Yeah, you did Almost it. Almost died. That's not fucking fair. These are the worst things in the entire game. They feel really, like, poorly coded and everything, too. Okay. There's a lot of sloppiness. Luke. Use the force. Luke, look at the force. I love Luke. Up we go. Oops. Why is it default to no? Why? Just to make me mad. <laughs> What's the most fuck you player game that there is? I'm trying to remember the name of it. The game the Japanese comedian had on the NES. Oh, Takeshi's Challenge? Is that yeah. what you're talking about? Where there's just deliberately sequences to make you lose your patience. Yeah. Or really stupid expectations. Let's go hang out with Michael, I suppose. But I have a theory that Nintendo does it sometimes. Just to, just to mess with people a little bit. Exactly. theory. I think of Sheldon in Splatoon. I think of Kapora Gibora and Zelda. Oh, you jumped over his thing. Wasn't that cool? <laughs> <laughs> if only someone would hire me for that. Wait, where's Michael live again? I uh, don't remember. It, it's funny too, because at the beginning of the game, they even have a pop-up box that says, you now know where Michael's house is. Mm. <laughs> is Can a... you give me a job? Hello? <laughs> job, please. He bangs on the windshield. <laughs> Want me to drive your car for you? I can drive you home. I took a picture. <laughs> <laughs> give it to him. Say, hey, I'm a photographer. $20. Is he in there? Please, Michael. Hi. What do you want? Why is she voiced? Hey. Is oh. Michael home? Michael? Wah. There is no Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Only... Oh, you must want the house next door. Yeah, Michael. Why do you sound like this? <laughs> what happened to you, my dear? Oh, my dear. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Why do you sound like that? The kid just runs. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> next door? Oh, over here? Yeah, in the car. Oh. <laughs> Michael lives Michael, in the car. Michael, wake up! <laughs> This one? That's he him. lives in the little doghouse. That's Snoopy. Yes? Can I help you? <laughs> yes? Is Michael home? Uh, yeah. But he's sick. There's something suspicious about you. Right, okay. Nothing to worry about. I didn't see. believe he was sick for a second. <laughs> he's just sick. Probably. Stupid panda, I hope he gets sick. <laughs> So I hope some pandemic just happens. Home. The record stop has the ultimate. El didn't even tell me to do that. <laughs> Don't worry, because it's in the pause menu. It technically counts as conveying <laughs> what you, do you need to do next. That was really weird. I know. <laughs> the game's chock full of that. Huh. I love Yeek. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go buy a nice DVD. T record stop. That angry bitch is still outside. I already forgot we're looking for this uh, mystical Ultima LP legend. Do I ask this guy? Hey man, I'm looking for this record. <laughs> hey man, uh. <laughs> what do you think Ugly Duck sounds it's like? called Mystical Ultima LP Legend. <laughs> nah man. You're cool. music. <laughs> I make all the choices here for the indie music. Okay. Uh, let me check. <laughs> He's clicking with his toes. <laughs> He's got a keyboard on his feet. <laughs> nah, we don't have it. It's like, yeah, I, th I think it's like sold out. It's like not real. Damn. Okay. Anyway, can you order it? Uh, the manager has to do that. But don't you pick the indie music here? You literally just said that. <sighs> I should have your job. Look, 
If you want something good, By the way, you got any openings? <laughs> they have a big selection, and they're usually down with the hip cat bands, you dig? Yeah, okay. This rocks. I love going all the way to the other town. Hooray! Well, time to travel that world map. Oh, this is getting super <laughs> annoying. I was actually enjoying it a lot up until, like, the there sewer. There will be story again, don't worry. <laughs> there was just so much padding. So much things <laughs> I had to bullshit my way through. Da, 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 da. Okay, Julian, tell me a story. Once upon a time, little Christian. <laughs> okay, that's Once good. upon a time. Once upon a time. There was a magic pa potato yeah. and... By yeah. the time anybody could ever eat it, it would always have rotted away, but it would always appear <laughs> somewhere else in the world. Yeah. Uh, and so the legend of the potato grew and grew until <laughs> it was the only thing that anybody on Earth ever cared about. Was, <laughs> the it, entire planet. It was magic potato. <laughs> That's a great story. And, uh, yeah. and uh, an evil wizard wished to obtain the potato. The potato. <laughs> Um, so, uh, he, he gained a cult following because, uh, because, you know, everybody cared about this potato so much. He had a cult following? Yeah, yeah he had lots of people who, uh, who did his bidding. <laughs> okay. Uh, but one of them was named, uh, Mr. Peterson. And, uh, Mr. Peterson, uh, he didn't like that his name started with the letter P. Okay. Because it reminded him of the potato that he would never obtain. Fair enough. Um... And so he decided to overthrow this uh, this evil wizard so that he could make everybody shut up about this fucking potato. <laughs> he just wants them to stop talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> shut up! So, uh, yeah. so he poisoned his... Uh, uh, it was the first night he poisoned his meal uh -huh. uh, when he was uh, eating dinner at his, like... He has one of those big, long tables with the one big chair at the end. Yeah. And he, he poisoned the turkey, but the wizard uh, only ate half of uh, the, the turkey. And so uh, instead <laughs> of being- the most convoluted story. <laughs> instead of being poisoned, he gained superpowers. Yeah. Uh, on the second night, Mr. Peterson uh, tried to rig his bathtub so that, uh, so that it would kill him. He tried to like hook up electrical wires to it. <laughs> but the yeah. wizard was unaffected by technology because he was magic. And so that didn't work either. Uh, on the third night, uh, he just he just went up and stabbed him. <laughs> yeah, and that was the end. That's the end of the whole story. That's the end of the story. So you tell me, but this. Julian, we didn't even make it to where we need to be in the game yet. It can't be over yet. <laughs> uh, okay, so sequel sequel time. Mm -hmm. uh, um, tur it turns out, Mr. Peterson, uh, he has to do it again. It all happened again. There there is a different wizard. Uh, so it follows all the same story beats. That way, you know, you capture the core audience that liked the original story. Um, but uh, but you, it's, you, a, can, it's a you can, like, reference key moments from yeah, the first one and, in the second and one, And then people too. always go, oh, they, oh do you, you know, it shows such love for the original story. Um, it, it, it changes things just enough to fool people who don't think very hard. Um... And, uh, and then it, he uses an NES advantage to control the Statue <laughs> of Liberty. But then they tried to do a, a third one, and nobody liked that one. I thought it was good. It was I think, okay. I think you don't get enough credit for your story. Did you see the video essay on it? I have a completely different feeling towards it now. <laughs> <laughs> Ding Dong's commentary channel is coming soon. Mm -hmm. Where he just talks shit on literally everyone, including his friends. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's just YouTube at this point, isn't it? Yeah. I think every creator just started doing that. <laughs> yeah. But it's kind of enjoyable. You have to admit. It's not like the thing we're doing right now is <laughs> contributing. No, uh we're helping. We're, we're giving we're valid up criticisms. <laughs> I like these rats. Is it raining? Mm -hmm. Not oh, only no. is it raining, it's pouring. And not only is it pouring, but the old man appears to be dead. <laughs> He went to bed and bumped his head. And he couldn't get and up in the morn. And he left a big mess. <laughs> old old man snorzels. Somebody had to clean up all that uh, all that brain matter from the wall. So this is Windy Town, huh? It is. I've never been here before. Yeah, it's a nice little place. You might like it here. Everybody's poor and miserable. Hmm. Can we go to the Lucky Mart? You can. Can we go to the vending machine? Can we apply for a job at- Oh, no, we're not doing that anymore. We have to- we have to find this record. Yeah. Mom, couldn't find a job. Gonna go buy some record I had a dream about. <laughs> I hate you, dear. 
<laughs> she smiles. <laughs> she smiles and pats him on the head. God, I hate you. <laughs> You're so annoying. Gives him a sack lunch. She wasted. I bet she spent like five hundred thousand dollars on his college. Uh, college tuition is really scary. Yes. It's the biggest reason that I don't regret uh, never going. Life sucks. Let's go in here. I went inside. They also didn't have it. They would you be furious if you came to this door and said it was locked, and then you just had to go to a different town altogether? It sure would suck if they also referred it, you to what? another town after this. Uh, oh, I'm looking for... It's not here. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Why is it the same guy? See, every, every time something like that happens, a wizard did it. It's like that Monty Python bit. Or because reality's breaking, whatever he said it was. Did, didn't they tell me to come here to they go did. to the record store? Talk to him again, maybe there's an option we miss. Nope. That is strange. Yeah, no, it just opens is straight up to the... Is there a different one that you're supposed to go to in this town or something? Because it's a bigger area than just this little stretch we're in. That would be strange. You could go past, like, the road now, probably, where the grave was. Hmm. Collection of music from your mother's favorite band. I'll buy that for her instead of getting a job. She'll be so happy. I can upgrade my weapon, Oh, maybe? you don't want it, Mom? Okay, I'll just use it as a weapon. That's all right. Thanks, music nerd. You didn't fucking help at all. <laughs> Does it give you any indication of whether uh, a weapon is better than the one you have? Or do, you <laughs> do you have to... Oh. Why did that say to do that? <laughs> Fuck you! It literally said go to Windtown! Yes, it did. Fuck off! <laughs> and I'm already here, so just fucking let me do it! Go to the end of the what game! <laughs> Code it in so Vela shows up! <laughs> Fuck you for making me go back! Look at this pathetic tiny man running through this open fucking town. Where do I go? <laughs> you have to go all the way back. <laughs> Mamma <Mind> uh... <laughs> You play for a minute. Oh no. What? Play for a minute. Uh, yeah. My eyes is getting to twitch. The ri you woke up. Like an hour ago. <laughs> You're already tired. What? No. We woke up at... 10. And now it's 2. Listen, he already hunted for two jobs. He's tired too. And we've already <laughs> been playing for two hours. Maybe I did skip over something, but I don't think I did. Did I? No, I don't think he did. The game's gaslighting me. <laughs> he didn't stop at some point to say, Fella, yeah. I'll go talk to Fella. No, everybody hates you right now. Why would you think to go do that? Yeah. Fella! Hang on. Wait. I need you! Something happened! <laughs> <laughs> they made me go all the way to Windtown! <laughs> I didn't read the hint! <laughs> the hint. Uh. Fella! Fella! <laughs> ah! Hey! Hello. Hey, Fella. Hey, Fella. You busy? <laughs> uh, can you get away from work for a bit? Can you quit your job for me and then I take your job? <laughs> I've got a plan. That would be really funny if he was manipulating her like that. How long do I need to be away for? Uh, not long. Just need to run to Windtown. So like three to four hours tops. You you want me to just walk away from my job for three to four he hours? He is making the worst impression with her possible. <laughs> It's, it's important. Uh, look, no one here really needs you to do your job. It'll be fine. Oh, you're such a piece of shit. I need the money, Alex. Hey, I'll pay you. What do you make an hourly minimum wage? I'll give you the 30 bucks. Oh, Alex. Alex, <laughs> you have no idea what hard work is. Yes. yes, I do. I went to Windtown and I had to come back here. You don't get having a purpose besides your own stupid whims. She is so fucking cool. To go from trying to save That's a really weird face she's doing. I can't believe she died. Every waking moment working at a freaking arcade? One second, you're banishing entities and exploring conspiracies, then bam, I have the feeling that maybe I frustrated her. Sure no but it could be me. Sure. It got my DDR game to be amazing, but I'm Cool reference. Mm -hmm. That came out a year prior. That was 1998. Hmm. One day, Alex, when you 
finally get a job? You'll understand how everything can't be conspiracies and missing mysterious beings. <laughs> I, I like him just standing there. He's not even looking at her. He's looking above her. He's probably looking at like a clock behind her like, yeah, yeah, okay, I get it. Mm. Okay. No, I get it. Yeah, yeah. Mm, I get it. Mm, I suck. Mm, mm. Oh, Alex, don't feel bad. No. Here, I'll do whatever it is you want. Oh, no, it actually didn't work. Shucks. I wanted to guilt her. Oh, yes, it worked! Wait, Alex. No, I get it. That's how you feel about me. Could you be any more of an entitled little brat? Last night, an entity was in my house. This changes everything. I followed it to an old radio tower, and there I found this. What the hell? Yeah, the entity was in my house. Calling me names! <laughs> Telling me I need to get a job! <laughs> Wait, that was my mom! <laughs> but then I killed her and now she is an entity! <laughs> this has to be a joke! Are you screwing with me? Where did you get that? Do us all a favor and don't try to find that record. What? What? Find that <laughs> record? Just let it go. Go get it? What does she know that you don't? Do you think that this is all connected? Sometimes a record is just a record and an entity just lives in your house. Oh, okay. Don't try and connect everything together like there is some giant cosmic plan. She says nervously, wiping her brow. Look. Don't look for that record. Oh, I'm going to. You <laughs> really can't stop me. Alex! Ugh, sometimes you just... <laughs> Why did you even come here? <laughs> come with me. No. Well, okay, fine. Fuck you. If you find it, just leave me out of it. I want nothing to do with it. What? Do you, like, really, really hate this band or something? That, I mean, she's on the cover of the album. <sighs> Alex, just get the hell out of here. I don't want to see you for a while. Sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, let's start wrecking up the plays. I really messed this up, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> So right now, uh -huh. he he's coming to her being like, I found something new. She's like, don't go any further, pretty much, right? And then he said, fuck you, I'm going to go do it anyways. Okay. I wonder what she's hiding. I wonder why this was a necessary step. He could have also just gone. But I guess we needed to make her angry first. Oh. Oh, my Ooh. God. Dude, glad to see you're feeling better. What do you mean? Your mom said you'd been under the weather when I stopped by this morning. Oh, yeah. <coughs> what are you up to? I, told I think that. Michael was lying to I me. I think he was trying to fuck Vela behind my back. <laughs> I think it is all connected after all. <laughs> Michael, were you in my house last night? Oh. Okay, so let's hit up Windtown. He took a photo. I heard it. While we're there, why don't we stop in and check on Rory? Make sure he doesn't hate you, our guts. I mean, it still spells out the same way. I know what you were trying to say. I almost got defensive. I almost pointed out how Rory endangered our lives with his I almost cared a lot off. about this. But I let it least externally. Almost a little bit. <laughs> almost kind of more than anything. This really was annoying. Walking, 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 walking. I'm, gonna, I'm having fun watching walking. it. Mm -hmm. Can you continue to do so? It's like I'm really there walking with Alex. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like it too. All right, are you ready to properly go to Windtown? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's go there. Where's Vela? Where's Vela? Where's Vela? <laughs> Wait, we need to go get her! <laughs> I love the way it made you go back for Vela, and then she didn't come anyway. <laughs> exactly! You went there just to start a fight with her, and then you left. There yeah. was no point. I Hope guess because you had to conveniently bump into Michael. Yeah. And then he didn't come either. Well, he's with us now. He's in, he's in your body? Yeah, he's in my body. You're carrying him in your belly? He walked in- he phased through me, <laughs> meaning he's in my party now. I like that. Yeah, do you like when that happens in RPGs? Everybody gets out of you and they go back in? The first time I saw that happening in Final Fantasy VII, I remember how, like, weird and shocking I found it. 